What is the Empress Wuzishan? Empress Wuzishan, also known as Wujiao or Wu Hu, was a Chinese empress who reigned during the Tang Dynasty from 690 to 705 AD. She holds the distinction of being the only woman in Chinese history to rule as an emperor in her own right. Wu Zixian's reign was marked by significant political and cultural achievements, as well as controversies and conspiracies. Early life and rise to power. Wu Zixian was born in 624 AD in Wenshui County, Shaanxi Province. Little is known about her early life, but it is believed that she came from a noble family. At the age of 14, she was selected to join Emperor Taizong's harem as a concubine. Taizong was impressed by her intelligence and beauty, and she quickly rose through the ranks of the imperial harem. After Taizong's death in 649 AD, Wu Zixian became a concubine of his son, Emperor Gaozong. She continued to gain influence at court and eventually became Gaozong's favorite concubine. In 655 AD, Gaozong suffered a stroke that left him partially paralyzed and unable to govern effectively. Wu Zixian took advantage of this situation and began to exert her influence over state affairs. Ruling as Empress Dowager. In 660 AD, Emperor Gaozong died and was succeeded by his eldest son, Emperor Zhongzong. However, Zhongzong's reign was short-lived, as he was deposed within a few weeks by Empress Dowager Wu. She accused him of plotting against her and had him placed under house arrest where he later died. Wu Zixian then installed her third son, Emperor Ruizong, on the throne but retained power as the de facto ruler. She ruled as Empress Dowager for the next several years. Implementing a series of political and administrative reforms, she reorganized the bureaucracy, strengthened the central government, and promoted officials based on their merit rather than their family background. Reign as Emperor In 690 AD, Wu Zixian took the unprecedented step of proclaiming herself Emperor, establishing the Zhou Dynasty. She justified her rule by claiming that she had received a divine mandate to become emperor. As emperor, Wu Zixian continued to implement reforms and policies aimed at consolidating her power and maintaining stability in the empire. During her reign, Wu Zixian surrounded herself with loyal advisors and officials who helped her govern effectively. She implemented land reforms to redistribute wealth and reduce inequality improved the education system, and promoted Buddhism as a state religion. Wu Zixian also expanded China's borders through military campaigns and diplomatic alliances. Cultural Achievements and Legacy Wu Zixian's reign was marked by a flourishing of art, literature, and scholarship. She patronized poets, scholars, and artists, many of whom produced works praising her reign. The Tang Dynasty is often considered a golden age of Chinese poetry, and many of its most famous poets lived during Wu Zixian's reign. Despite her accomplishments, Wu Zixian's rule was not without controversy. Many historians have criticized her for ruthlessly eliminating political rivals and for her authoritarian governing style. There were also rumors of cruelty and even murder surrounding her reign. After ruling for 15 years, Wu Zixian abdicated the throne in 705 AD at the age of 81. She installed her eldest son, Emperor Zhongzong's son Li Xian, on the throne as Emperor Ruizong. However, she continued to hold significant influence over state affairs until her death in 705 AD.